I am quickly gonna go make a coffee with my new Starbucks cup. I'm buying on a break my shot. Today is Christmas and I'm doing my annual what I got for Christmas video that all YouTubers do that is super unoriginal but everyone does it and everyone still likes it so. This year I didn't really ask for very much because I don't really like, I don't know what the word is, I don't really like receiving gifts. Is that weird? I feel like it is but I'm not a big gift person and also during the year like if I need something if it's like for school, for videos, for my room, I usually just buy it. So by the time Christmas comes around I'm like I really don't need anything. Let me know in the comments how your Christmas was. I hope it was amazing. My Christmas was amazing. It's the first Christmas that Matthew, my br oldest brother, lives in Denver, so it's nice to have him come back. And then my sister lives alone, and she was back, so it was just really nice to have us all together. Okay, so I got a few pieces of clothing. I got a cute pair of jeans. I haven't tried any of these on yet, so I don't even know if they fit or not, but I'm pretty sure they will. So I got this light blue pair of jeans. I actually have a pair that look exactly like this, but I lost them out of nowhere recently. They, they just disappeared. I took them on a trip somewhere, and they were in my mom's car, and now they're just they're just gone so very weird these ones are high-waisted I think they're from like a Hollister I don't know I don't know where they're from and then at the bottom they're not skinny jeans they're like slightly big which are my favorite style of jeans I don't know what the style is called it's either boyfriend or mom jeans then I got two sweaters one in pink that looks like this it's super comfy really cute and it says wellness invest in your happiness which is so deep and I really like the color I think this color looks great on me it's like very bright then I got this chonky sweater oh it's from Paxson it's light blue and it has a collar on it I love how clothing items look with little collars on them. I think it's so cute and so pretty. I see a lot of people on TikTok wear them. Um, but yeah, it's like a giant sweater. Super, super comfortable. That would be great for the winter. And apparently in Texas, it's supposed to snow this January. So I'm going to be decked out. Then I got two more clothing pieces. I got a royal blue workout tank top. Royal blue is one of my favorite colors to wear. Oop. Then I got this white shirt. I actually remember asking for this because I wanted something that had a collar on it. Since it's a halter top, basically I could put this with a jacket, with a sweater, and the collar could just come out. Then my dad got me a coffee at home book. There's like a ton of coffee recipes in here. And then there's just like how to make coffee at home. There's like how to make espresso, how to grind beans, how to do cold brew. There's so many things in here. And I kid you not, I was looking, I was reading through this book and there was pictures all over like this. And it literally just like made me so excited. So I'm definitely going to have to to, like sometime go to the store buy all the ingredients that these recipes need and like recreate a whole bunch of them That'd be so much fun. Then I got some moisturizer This is the only moisturizer that has ever made my skin feel nice literally ever, but it's so expensive So I had my mom get me <laughs> I like really a really big tube of it because it's it's literally life-changing dermatology Jika then I got some film for my Polaroid camera. I have this Polaroid and it is so let me get it out it's so vibey. It's literally adorable, but I run out of film all the time. And my goal for this year is to do a Polaroid at least a month, one a month. Because the thing is, when I look back at Polaroids, I'm always so thrilled to have those pictures. So when I don't do them, I'm just disappointed with my own self. Then I asked for coasters, which is such a mom gift. But the thing is, I always have iced coffee when I'm working on my desk or like an ice water smoothie or something. And I keep putting on my desk, but the wood is starting to like bubble up and like if you look closely enough that it's like coming up like it's getting off the surface so I needed coasters so we just got these plain marble ones which are so pretty oh I hate that noise that is painful so yeah I'm really excited about those to keep my beautiful little desk healthy then I got hair dryer. I've been needing a new hair dryer for a while. I got like a $10 hair dryer at the beginning of the summer and it worked for a little while but now it's to the point where I'll blow dry my hair and every single time my hair comes out dry, crusty, crispy, and frizzy so I can't really use it. I don't know exactly how that works because I don't know much about hair dryers but I have a feeling that like the heat of the hair dryer is just too hot and there's no cold setting so it just barely works. But every time I use like a hotel's hair dryer it always works super duper well. So my mom says she researched this and it's apparently really nice. It has a cold setting and it has a diffuser. A diffuser is a thing that looks like this and it basically takes longer to dry your hair but it comes out more natural and it basically encourages your natural hair to dry so it's super cool and I'm really into like a natural look like I've been loving doing my hair really curly and like kind of wavy right now it's just dry and crispy because I had to blow dry it I'm really excited to use that I'm actually gonna use that today because I want to see how it works then I got these pants these are the this is the clothing item I actually like the most okay so they're these little joggers I have ones that look just like it but these ones are like from a really nice brand they're that cold athletic material where they always just feel kind of cold there's pockets there's drawstring and they're just so so 
adorable. I'm really excited to try them on and see what they look like. I love them. I can't wait to work out in the new year. I'm going to be such a so vibey. My little brother got me gloves, which is amazing. When I went to Denver, I got some new gloves and I had a coat and this whole little system going. I looked so cute. And then I lost one of my gloves in Denver. Ugh. My sister Laura got me a water bottle because we always talk about how I need to drink more water, but I never have something to drink it in. And so I only use like little plastic cups. And that doesn't encourage you to drink water. So she got me a cute little drink. Mark Adam got me this backpack. It's so cute. He basically said, he was like, I know you already have a little backpack, but this one's better. And I agree. I think it's super duper cute. I like the black. I have a little mini backpack, but it's like rose gold. So it's always nice to have a black one. Then my other sister got me some car stuff. So this upcoming month of January, I am turning 16. I'm getting a car. I'm getting my license and I'm getting my Invisalign off. It's going to be a huge month for me. I'm so excited. And so my sister thought it would be great to help get me into the spirit. This is a keychain for my keys. There's a little pom-pom. There's two of these tassels, one green, one brown, and then there's a pretty A. I already feel so cool. Like when I have keys, guys, I'm gonna be so happy. And then she got me some car fresheners. These don't smell like lavender. And I'm literally, the second I got it, I just pictured me sitting in a car, like with my new sweaters and my new yoga pants, with my car freshener up there and just living my own little life. I'm so excited. From the day this video posts, it'll be exactly a month away. Then I got a chessboard. I got a chessboard last year for Christmas. But in the middle of the year, it went missing. Like, no one is admitting to taking it. No one is saying they know where it is. So I'm just assuming that it disappeared, which obviously isn't true, but I don't know. I love playing chess. It really racks my brain, but it's my favorite thing to do. Then my mom got me this. This is so funny. So it's a selfie kit for tick making TikToks. It has an LED light that, like, puts color. So if I want to do one of those emo transitions with, like, the blue, I can do that really really well and really easily with this. My sister got me this, it's Lash Boost. This is one of the only products I will swear by in the beauty world. It's a lash serum. If I use it for a week every day, just put it right on my lashes, sleep with it on, whatever, my lashes will grow instantly. The only issue with it is that the second you stop using it, it runs out, which is usually every six months, your eyelashes replace and they're just back to the normal height. So I kind of have to keep buying it, which is a struggle, but when it works so well, it's like, it's worth it. The main gift I asked for was sour tickets but if y'all know anything about Sour and Olivia Rodrigo tour there's like this huge thing where you have to sign up and get on a waiting list which is so annoying and we never made it off of the waiting list basically they just randomly choose people and then it's like oh yeah you can buy tickets but you can't and you can't and so it's it's really weird i was like well i still want to go to a concert because i feel like the april may time is the perfect time for concerts and it's just like a good time and i haven't been to a concert in like two years. So my mom got me tickets to a Tate McRae concert. I like her music. I haven't heard a lot of her new music, so I'll have to learn it all off by April. But on April 14th, I'm gonna go see a Tate McRae concert and that's gonna be really fun. But yeah, that's everything that I got. I'm super blessed and very happy and excited um, to have had such an amazing Christmas. So thank you to my family for everything. And now I'm gonna shower and try the hair dryer because I am very curious. Out of the shower, I changed my clothes. Oh, I'm wearing the little black pants. They're really cute. They just look like something I would wear. Hang on. You can't really see. They're cute. They just look like something I would wear literally all the time. Like it looks like something I've already owned. Which is a good thing. That's like how you know you kind of get, get a style going is when you think, oh, I feel like I already own this. I'm going to set up this hair dryer. I kind of don't know how to work a diffuser. Like I don't know if my hair is going to, because you know, if your hair dries in humidity, it gets frizzy. So I don't know if that's what a diffuser for. I, I don't know. I guess I'll have to read the instructions, which is like, Oh, painful. I hate reading instructions of, on anything. I feel like, oh, I can just do it myself, and then it goes wrong, and then I'm mad at the product. But I'm like, I also didn't read the instructions. Mm -mm. Ooh, that's scary. There's absolutely no instructions on the diffuser part. It's literally just how to regular dry your hair. So I'm just gonna wing it. And my hair I'll just wash it again. Oh my gosh, this is quite bizarre. Okay, there we go, wasn't a screw on. Okay, I took a break from drying my hair because it was literally taking a long time and my mom came in and I started trying on my clothes that I got. Look how cute this royal blue shirt is. Wait, can color you even see it? Yeah, royal blue has always been like my favorite color. And then I love these joggers uh -huh. for working out and for lounging around. Super cute. Okay, I pretty much finished my hair. I love it. So it definitely took longer than regular blow drying, but that's because it's so much more, there's my mom. 
it's so much more natural than regular hair drying because regular hair drying is like that big and it's so concentrated and it's so intense but the diffuser is so nice and like it's it's spread out look it looks so cool i like i love it it's super cool it's not completely dry but i feel like for the most part it's pretty it's pretty solid i don't want to keep drying it so did you, pretty did you try this on um i feel like light oh, blue oh no yeah, I feel colors. like light blue is restricted for people with blue eyes. I don't know, it's just a thing. Like, this color kind of makes me look like I'm sick. Doesn't it? I look like I have a cold. And then mom puts it on and she looks like a supermodel. My goal next week is to organize this drawer because I want my coasters to look good in here. Laura, I'm drinking your water bottle. Are you proud of me? Yes. I think Mark Adam is excited about his VR. Hello, it is Christmas night. I'm honestly gonna get dinner and then go to sleep. I love you besties. I hope your holiday season was amazing. I'm excited for this next chapter. Like January is gonna be crazy. I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye! Merry Christmas.